that door. Great. Now throw it. I hope the noise distracts him. Well done. Sitting there. We must get out before they recover. Get ready, people. Guards! You have to go sneak through the courtyard. Take the door the guards are coming through. Here, quick! Let's go! Who are you? Andre Valerius here, the train engineer. Run now! Just get to that hangar and then God willing, I'll get you out of here. They do me, so I'll get there easily. Why are you helping us, Andrei Ivanovich? I had... Uh, ah, I guess I'll tell you later. I hope... Uh, hey guys, what's going on? Hey! Hey! Artun, I see the enemy. Give me a boost. Can't really see well with the snowstorm. Don't forget your visibility gauge, Atyom. If you don't move too fast and don't come out into the light, you... Atyom, here coming two of them. I'll give you some cover from above.
Attention! The command center came under enemy attack! Change of position, Antioch! Am I glad to see you here? Are you alright? I'm fine, thank you. Alright. We don't have much time. They'll be back. I'll go to the engine. It should be ready now. You go up there and Come switch on, the Tom. turntable mechanism on.
Come on, Artyom, we don't have all day. legislation dictates they be killed. In any case, I have to get them out of town until it all blows over. But you all should stay. Hear me, Major? My people are in no way related to not my this call and you're not misunderstanding. Well, I'll jam. fight for the guys no matter what. Of course. Artyom, Anna, they are the with us. The no one behind. Alright, Spartans. Throw these overboard and full steam ahead. Come with me, Artyom. Let's catch them there. 
I'm so glad the boys supported us. It looks like my father didn't say a word to them about this either. We spent 20 years in Metro, thinking the rest of the world was burnt to a crisp in the war. But they just circled Moscow with those jammers, and we were none the wiser. How perfect of them!
Not just traitors. We are honest to God enemy saboteurs. We stopped a hundred clicks from Moscow to check our Geiger counters. The thing is, they are all in the green, as if they're in a conspiracy. Still, this amazing piece of We are at a crossroads, so to speak, where everybody can help but wonder, what next? Where do we go from here? Hmm, yes. More or less what I expected from you. But you got the picture. So, is your counter functioning? Have you checked it? Yes, it's all green. Double checked it. Stepan's in the green too. We don't need masks here. So, they were telling the truth. Who was telling the truth? Why won't you answer? Who were those people trying to kill us? Why would they shoot at you, the Order's commander? Explain something, at least! You owe us that! Well, I might as well drop the bomb now. The war did not end. What do you mean, uh, did not end? Let me finish. Most of our cities are destroyed. The rest of the country is probably under enemy occupation to avoid new nuclear attacks against us. Command chose the only viable course of action, to play dead. To ensure radio silence, the SHIELD system was created. A network of radio jammers covering Moscow and suburbs. So that some radio enthusiasts wouldn't bring more bombs down on our heads by whining on air. And it's one of these jammers that got disabled by the hands of those present here. Could you not have shared that before? Say, before Artyom took that radio outside and caught all that radiation? No! I only got briefed half a year ago. Under a strict, you talk, you die policy. And then had to tell my people we were securing a weather station. Sir, with all due respect, if we can't go back, maybe we should advance and move on? I have an idea, but... Uh... Artyom, rather than carrying on with this silent disapproval of yours, check the airwaves. We should be out of the jamming range by now, so give it your best try. Look for transmissions from the Ark. <sighs> Do you understand now why we are traitors in the eyes of command? We shut down a jamming station, shot up the guards, destroyed a patrol train, and ran away from Moscow. Who even needs a trial when the case is so clear? There's no way back now. Which means we have to continue moving forward. Command, what are you talking about? The Moscow Defense Command. Have you ever heard of the Invisible Watchers? I have, but they're just an urban legend. Not at all. They are command. Are you sure they care for more than just protecting their asses? You mentioned the Ark. What's that all about? If Artyom finds their signal, you'll figure everything out. Otherwise, there is nothing to talk about. Do you think finding that Ark of yours is going to fix everything? I do not. 
But if you have a better idea, then go ahead. Yes, I do. We have to find a good place for people from Moscow, like Artyom always wanted. Giving them all to the enemy? A grand idea. I say, we solve our problems before moving on to saving all Moscow, all right? How is it going, Artyom? Found it yet? There's a whole world out here! A world where we could live! So far, we only know one thing for sure. Radiation levels are nominal. The air is breathable. But what about the rain? So what? You can't even breathe in Moscow. So? Does anybody live out here? We don't know. How will they treat us? I don't know that either. What would they do if they found out there are survivors in Moscow? Again, I don't know. Keep looking, Artyom. It's got to be a signal. But we do know we've been lied to. For 20 years, we've been lied to. We know they've been killing people. Collateral damage is inevitable in operations of such scale and secrecy. Yes, people have died. But the bombs killed tens of millions. Yet we are alive. We stayed alive throughout those years. Artyom almost got killed. Is he just collateral damage too? Guess what? Yes. If you have to choose between the life of a single man, no matter how dear he is to you, and the lives of everybody else, all the dwellers of Metro, then there's nothing to think about. Are you looking for it, Artyom? Come on, do your best. Would you say the same about me? And about myself, too. I've spent my whole life protecting the people of Metro. Do you get it? My whole life. And I wouldn't hesitate for a second. I'm prepared to do anything to ensure Metro survives. Even though they'd shoot me on sight if I returned now, it doesn't matter. Too many lives are at stake. Too many lives have already been sacrificed to hesitate now. Too many. I'm sorry. I didn't want to. I mean, but we have to make up our minds. How will things finish for all of us if we start out lying to each other and arguing? We need to be better. You ask me how things will finish. Well, let me tell you, it all depends on Artyom now. If he finds the frequency, if they are alive. <sighs> Found it yet, Artyom? Please, try! It must be there! <sighs> Keep looking, Artyom. It's got to be a signal. <sighs> are you looking for it, Artyom? Come on, do your best! <sighs> Found it yet, Artyom? Please, try! It must be there! <sighs> Keep looking, Artyom. That's got to be a signal. Found it yet, Artyom? Please, try! It must be there! Are you looking for it, Artyom? Come on, do your best! <sighs> Nothing yet, Artyom! <sighs> this signal has got to be there! Look some more! Are you looking for it, Artyom? Come on, do your best! Nothing yet, Artyom! This signal has got to be there! Look some more!
Keep looking, Artyom. That's got to be a signal. <sighs> Found it yet, Artyom? Please, try! It must be there! what you had in mind yes this is it the ark project is a whole city underground enormous stores machines the best experts it is the commander general's hq all of the country's leaders are there they have already started the restoration work we will tell them that moscow is alive it wasn't all for nothing everything will change everything do you get it a new life is starting for all the survivors of the world. Yeah. Oh, by the way, are there any single women in that place? <laughs> Great reaction. So I think the moment calls for. <clears throat> Bring it out to me. Bring what out, Colonel? Sir, that thing that's been sloshing about in your canteen. Do <laughs> you think I'm deaf or what? Ah, uh, that. Uh, just a moment. I, I thought my ears were deceiving me. <laughs> 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 It's not a short trip to the Urals, so we should make ourselves comfortable, I guess. Let's name this bucket of bolts at the very least, eh? It's about time. Let's go around and be done with it. <laughs> nah, go to hell. <laughs> Even better. Oh, come oh, on. Aurora, the Roman goddess of dawn and a cruiser of, uh, uh, you know what. That's better. <laughs> Not bad. I like it. Ah, beautiful name. Sounds okay, but the cruiser of what? Yeah, I'll tell you later. Looks like it's decided. <laughs> Let's trick you. <laughs> <them. sighs> <sighs> hey, Artyom, Let's take a look at that map. All right, we had a round. That should be enough. You're back. Full steam ahead! Hi! Full steam ahead! Wow, that's some distance. I wonder how long it will take. How are you, Alyosha? Oh, Anna. I was expecting an arrow from a kid, but I got a bullet from an ugly motherfucker instead. <laughs> you sure you're okay? Because I know you. After all those years in the underground, the air of the surface seemed incredibly fresh, intoxicating. But that was not what had caused the crew's euphoria. Our journey finally got a definite purpose provided by the transmission from the government bunker in the Urals. For 20 years, we thought that neither the government nor military high command had survived. Turns out they're still around. Where were they? while we were eating each other alive in the metro. We'll have a lot of qu- Rose, anything off yet, darling? <laughs> Here, let's warm you up a little bit. 
So, what do you think our chances of getting to Yamantau alive are? It's the only thing on my father's mind. How to earn his forgiveness, get back to Metro and his old life, the life you had always been running from. And to think, I never believed you. And now I'm looking at this fog, thinking it could actually be hiding our new life from us. By the way, we should be approaching the bridge soon. Damn it! A campfire! People! There are people there! Hit the brakes! Shots fired! Four bogeys on a trolley! Farts. Old farts, huh? That's just the perimeter guard. They could put anyone there, even women and children. Do you really think we found them, Colonel? Well, we can't be sure. I was expecting to run into them much earlier. The trolley is headed towards the bridge. Some fortifications there. This looks peaceful. A village and a church on the water. We need intel. Here, Artyom, I put a mark on your map. Get there and find out what you can about that breach. Taking a prisoner would be ideal. Anna, you cover him. Yes, sir. May I go with Artyom, too? As backup? No. Until we figure out our situation, you are not to take a step away from the Aurora. These two can handle themselves just fine. Yermak, when can you get the Aurora running again? I don't know yet. Go and check out that cylinder, but a full day at least. I see. Let's go, Artyom. Let's prepare the Aurora for defensive action. Artyom, don't forget your backpack. It's a new model. A portable workshop, so to speak. The manual is inside. It doesn't come with crafting materials, though, so keep an eye out for those. Let's move out, Artyom. Just be careful out there. Sure thing. I gotta say, that was one flimsy roadblock. And those guys, well, they didn't look like army men at all. Just old men. Be careful out there. Remember, most of the country has been destroyed or occupied. Even those who speak our language might be enemies, by conviction or out of fear. Do you hear that bell? We must have given them a good scare. Something. 
There's a boat at the dock. Looks like it's the locals' preferred method of transportation. All right, I'll climb up there while you take the boat and go to the church. I'll call you when I'm settled. Break a leg. Father, Salantius, has already started his sermon. Just enter the temple and see the light. Here either. Silantius locked us up here a year ago. 
Yes, the bridge dwellers won't even talk to heretics. But I'll tell you everything I've seen Our in this young, place all that year. Our arriving under the cover of fog. Oh, it's the bridge guard. Silentia has fooled them just like the locals. But unlike them, the bridge guard have guns. Run! There's a way out down here and there's a boat at the dock. We also have one, but it's too small for all of us. Our job, she's alive to get to the boat. We will rescue her later. Don't worry. Go! Nothing I can get to you. Where is that heretic? She came by boat during the sermon. And then what? Well, he, he was just there and then kind of disappeared. <laughs>
Artyom, over here! sent me out as a forward sentry, told me that I was to sit tight and under no circumstances look for any action. So I just had a front row seat watching you there. And holy shit, you did not disappoint. Anna has already reported on the call. How about we trade places? I'd hate to come back to Moscow without even firing once. I was trying to win a girl over from one trader. Tough luck there. Why does everybody else get fun missions? The colonel does criticize you and all, but he gives you all the best action. Is this his way of showing affection or trying to get you killed? But I have to say it's unfair. I've been dragged out of Moscow and for what? Stalking the furnace and sitting in the forces huh i'm sorry i don't quite get what you so you've never seen any foreign army in this area no i haven't seen any army but we haven't really been to any important places i see hmm. Artyom, a moment Artyom, stop by my desk once you're done talking to the old man. I've got something for you. Great job saving them, Artyom. Katya here has provided us with vital information. A mechanic called Crest is hiding in the port. His help is required if we're to fix the Aurora in the foreseeable future. Yermak can't handle the repairs alone. So, once you're ready, go to the port and invite Crest to join us. Then get back ASAP. We'll have to decide what to do about the fanatics on that bridge. Now we know for sure that the bridge is in working order. They crossed it last year when they got here. Well, at least some things are clearer now. But still, so many questions. There might not even be any enemy forces around here at all. They probably get us in the key regions only. In any case, we'll learn everything once we reach Yamantau, from the top source. The Moscow government is essentially a local council, to put things in perspective. 
So, now we just need to figure out how to cross this goddamn bridge.